If your pump motor runs but does not deliver water, loss of prime could be the problem. What is loss of prime and what does it mean for your pump? Loss of prime simply means that there is no water in the pump casing. Without water, your pump will not be functional. So, what can cause loss of prime? Well, there are three primary causes. One, there is no water available from the water supply. And two, the suction assembly has an air leak. And three, debris is caught at the foot valve filter and or your strainer. Now let's take a look at how to identify and resolve these problems. Let's start with water availability. In a pressurized system, if no water is available from the water supply, check to make sure all valves are open. If water does not flow, there may be an air leak. Don't forget, if your pump runs on city water, the city may have turned the water off. Always make sure this is not the case before testing for air leaks. If you're pulling water from a ditch or a pond, verify the water level is above the suction intake. Now let's move on to a suction air leak. If the suction assembly has an air leak, you will either need to repair it or replace it. An easy way to check for air leaks is to wrap plastic wrap around a few potential problem areas on the suction side. These can include the filter, any gate or ball valves, any threaded parts or PVC glued on the suction side. Once wrapped, turn on the pump. If an air leak exists, the plastic wrap will tighten to the area. And last but not least is debris in the system. If debris is caught in the intake filter foot valve and or the strainer, it will need to be removed and the part cleaned. Don't forget to check for debris in the foot valve that is submerged in your water source, as well as the inline strainer. Debris can hold the foot valve wide open, causing the suction line to drain. If water is flowing after following these steps, the problem has been resolved and you and your pump can return to normal. If these steps didn't resolve your problem, visit other tips on our website at monroepump.com or ask your local pump dealer for help.